UNC Charlotte really wasn't on the map much before I went there, you know, just going there and, you know, putting together some good season. You know, we went to the NCAA tournament three times and my senior year we met Carolina. They was number one in the country. You know, they had Jameson, they had Vince Carter, you know, they had Shamal Williams, Ed Coda. Had a great team, number one team at that time in the country. So it was back and forth and then we went up, I think we was up at halftime, maybe four. We still, you know, we still maintained. We went back and forth for the rest of the half in the type of situation where, you know, it was kind of like uh, maybe two seconds, a second left and we had to throw it from half court and I got the ball and, you know, tried to lob one up, but, you know, it just wasn't, it wasn't long enough. I think we ended up losing the overtime by six or seven. Kind of like you have to be there to, to really experience it because everybody's getting crazy, everybody's painting their face, everybody ha has on their university t-shirts or sweatshirts. Everybody's fighting, you know, one game. That's all you have. One game and you're out. One game and you're out. One game and you're out. See, you're gonna, you're, gonna, you're gonna make me show my bracket. I like Louisville, I like Carolina, of course. Um, Duke, Louisville, Carolina, UConn. Those are my four and I got Carolina winning it over UConn. Take me to my grave and when I go there I know that I won't be alone Cause I've been started, let it be many, many times before Easy, please, the least from my shoes I will be flying above The hatred and the love and if you see me I'm it, you could better be a girl My move from, from probably since like high school up and under I don't really use it as much as I used to but it was always a, a go-to move. I watched Kevin McHale do it. Lakers, uh, Boston series in the 80s when I was a young kid. So, you know, I feel like you can always go to that move. He's been a great leader. He's been uh, a good guy for us on and off the court. You know, I know him. I played with him before. I knew he could help us uh, in, in the post-scoring. Uh, and more than just scoring, he's just, he just been another leader that we needed. Somebody with some experience. Uh, in top levels. I think we'll stay. I think we'll stay in the league. I mean, you know, we, we have some, uh, we have uh, six games, five games left. I think we'll do enough to stay in the league. And I think that's good because I think Rishon needs to be in the league because they have a history. They've been around for a long time. So we need to preserve that. We need to do, you know, the guys, us 10, 12 guys, we need to do a good job preserving Rishon and, and keeping Rishon in the league. Walking out of the circle Step by step I'm learning alone